The Alexander von Humboldt is one of the biggest hopper dredger in Europe. And today we've got an exclusive view of its daily work. The dredging here is taking 45 minutes. How much material are you dredging up? When it's full, about nine and a half thousand cubic meters. That's about 8,000 truckloads. Wow. This dredger has a suction pipe. At the end of this pipe, there's a suction head, which looks a bit like the end of a vacuum cleaner hose. It can be lowered onto the bottom, and then using a powerful pump, it sucks up the muck. Just like a vacuum cleaner sucks up dirt from the floor, the mud can be sucked up here. So why does the port of Hamburg need to be dredged regularly? Well, the Elbe River constantly brings with it a fresh supply of silt, and because the current is not as strong in the harbour pools, that silt can settle on the floor of the river and form sediment. We dredge that muck up, which we need to, to make sure the water is deep enough for the ships. Now we're very close to the Kulbarnbrücke, and you really get an impression of this ship's size. That's right, the bridge is 54 meters high, and we can just squeeze through. But it's close, isn't it? Amazing. As you can see, the loading bay is very full. Now the ship's heading down the Elbe to Lestant. That's where we're taking the sludge. So now we've arrived in this stand, and as you can see, the sludge is being unloaded. You can see how quickly the loading bay is draining. It all happens pretty quickly. It takes about a minute, and then it's back in the River Elba. So it's been a successful day then. You've unloaded the sludge. Yes, a successful day's dredging. And thanks very much for letting us come along today. I'd like to say goodbye to the Alexander von Humboldt and as we say here in Hamburg, see you next time, tschüss!